Verify Team Inbox has been full of questions about stimulus checks. Literally hundreds of emails we received in the last couple days. So we decided to hold a Facebook Live. We spoke with Henry Grez from the American Institute of CPAs and took questions live. Let's give you a recap, starting with the basics. Question one, how big are these checks and who qualifies? This time around, uh, the checks are a little smaller. They're $600 per person. And that's just for individuals making $75,000 or less. Couples making $150,000 or less will qualify for a $1,200 check. Above those incomes, the checks start to phase out, dropping to zero for individuals at an income of $87,000. And for couples, it hits zero with a joint income of $174,000. All of this is based off your income from your 2019 tax filings. Then there are dependents, $600 for each of them. So let's verify which dependents will qualify. If the dependent was 16 years old or younger at the end of 2019, uh, they would qualify assuming the parents met the income threshold. That means dependents who are 17 and up will not qualify. And to put a point on it, that includes adult dependents. That is correct. So uh, many situations, uh, parents are now living with their children. Uh, their, their children are supporting their parents. Um, those adults would not qualify. Okay, let's go to a speed question. Let's verify, will these checks be taxed or garnished for things like child support? You will get the check, it will not be uh, garnished for child support. Finally, here's question four. What should you do if you don't receive a check? Or if you still haven't received your first check? Now what you need to do is file a 2020 income tax return. More specifically, you'll turn to this, the 1040 tax form. You'll be able to inform the IRS if you believe you're owed money for either yourself or a dependent. All right, how about one more bonus verify? What if you had a baby in 2020? Will you get a check for them? Well, Chris says that the answer is yes and no. You're not gonna get a check for them because this is based off of 2019 taxes, but come tax season, you should be able to get a tax rebate with that money. Reporting here at the Capitol, I'm Evan Kozlov with your Verify.